Okay, well, it's quite nice that the the folks at Yule Wolf, uh, you know, added Arctic Fox rather quickly because right now Tomb Forks are pretty much dying across the board. There might be like one or two exceptions. I think one of them is rare, which, funny enough, I already left, and that sucks for me because uh, I think rare er with an R 10x for whatever reason. But they also the team also said that they want to like do a fresh start. As soon as I saw that, I was like, all right, I'm out. So, I don't know. I still take a loss on that, but let's see. It was all from compounding, so I was just adding money to it. So, technically, it's house money. Uh, and then I also was pulling out some profits. So, eh, it's not too bad, but still kind of sucks. Uh, but, I mean, they're still a nice crew, so it's just like, ah, uh, I, I just don't, I, I don't want to do it. I, I, I was willing to put up with it with Snow Tomb and Z Zilla, but I'm never doing that crap again. So, it's like, whatever. So, I mean, nowadays, I'm all about more stable projects. Basically, anything tied to Titano Forks. And even that, so I'm going to try to cover some more Titano Forks, and I have one for, uh, for today as well. Uh, however, I'm not going to invest in that, because apparently I only have one or two devs there. So, you know, the, the condition is, the site has to look pretty nice. I don't want a crappy looking site, like the, the, the one that I'm going to cover, it's called Demeter. Uh, and, well, I mean, I guess it shouldn't be, I mean, Caesar does look like crap, but they're actually really good, so there's that, but I still have to look for, like, an active dev team. So, again, you know, I'll probably just, like, buy it, you know, I'll have an initial pump, and then it'll dump, right, as always, and then it'll consolidate. It's when that, it, when it consolidates, and it's been a couple of weeks, then I'll look at it. So, actually, I should probably, I don't know, we'll talk about it when we get to Demeter. I'll be like the last video for today, I think. So anyway, uh, so Fox is having a bit of a bounce. I think it's up, uh, let me see, what is it up? I think it was like 36% let me see. Fox is up 35% in the last 24 hours, and in the last hour it's up 2.75%. Because at one point Fox was worth like less than a dollar, I think, or, or pretty close to that. So it's just like, man, everything's just getting killed right now. And I'm kind of surprised that Yield Wolf has not listed uh, Polar Bear Finance? Yeah, Polar Bear, whatever it is, right? But the Yield Wolf uh, mod said that she's they're looking at it, so they're keeping an eye on it, so, okay. But, I mean, again, you know, if you're going to get on Yield Wolf, they really want to make sure that you're renounced, KYC'd in some form, and you're legit. Right? And even then, you know, you still could have projects that uh, rug. Like Pulse Style, but the odds are so much lower. And the only reason why Pulse Style rugged was because, you know, the, just they were angry. That's why you can't trust angry people, right? Which is why I'm not going to go into Eris, even though I know it's going to be a good project. Because he keeps changing his mind and they get angry, right? I know I occasionally get angry, but that's not a good thing. You know, that's, that's the difference. So it's like, you know what, I'm not going to, whatever, you know, like any asshole can, you know, copy and paste the Titano or Seifu or whatever protocol code that you want. So it's like, it's not that big of a deal. I mean, shit, I mean, crypto and markets are doing shit right now anyway, right? Because we're all basically waiting for the stupid Fed tomorrow. It's always, it's always the Fed, right? It's always the central banks and we control everything. So we just got to. You know, make uh, make the central banks work for us instead of against us, right? Those are really the only two choices, right? There's no in between. There's no exceptions. All right. So anyway, so it's nice to revisit good old Arctic Fox. You know, the guys at Snowy Owl are working really, really hard. You know, they're doing the best that they can with you know the crap that's going on right now. So technically, Fox is 3.25 above peg. I didn't care. I bought it anyway because at this point, I really just have to have something. I don't even care what it is, right? Because shit, because everything's going to shit. <laughs> so it's like, well, you know, what are you gonna do, right? And you know, well, yeah, yeah, I'll leave it at that. So, all right. So it looks like we got our pick of five clown farms that we can uh, go into. I know there's a single stake. I don't think Fox Snow is in here, right? There's, wait. Uh, oh, I didn't actually notice this. Okay, so we've got Fox Snowshares. We have Fox Snow. Fox 
snow. Oh, so okay, they do have all five. Yeah, because I see five here. Okay, so they did list everything. Okay, so it's just a little disorienting. You have fox shares, snow shares, fox and snow, fox share and Joe, and fox Joe. So in my case, I just simply went with fox Joe. Uh, simply because A obviously has the highest APRs, right? Uh, and on top of that, despite everything that's happening right now, snowy owl snow tokens are still like struggling like really badly so i'm like oh boy you know I, so basically i can kind of see what the future is going to look like you know because fox share is going to last for another two months so they're just going to just keep doing this thing so i'm definitely just going to take aggressive profits like you know 50 percent, maybe even 60 or 70 well 70 percent is a lot but i might do it but i'm definitely pulling pulling on at least 50 percent a day right because the only way i'm going to make money big good to me, good money on it every day is if, you know, Fox, like, 4Xs in price. And then Joe tokens go back to, like, a dollar thirty. So, basically, I have to wait for the fucking Fed to raise interest rates. They better raise interest rates tomorrow or we're all screwed, right? Because that's the thing. But I think everybody knows that now, and the Fed even figured it out. Okay, we've, we've written the line as long as we could. We have to raise interest rates, right? Because, they're remember, right, these people are tribals, right? The, the assholes that run the, the evil assholes run the world. They, you know, they're about as greedy and evil as they come. Like, it, what you think is greedy and evil is nothing compared to what these people actually are, all right? Just go look at what's happening in Russia and Ukraine, and you'll see for yourself how evil and greedy these assholes really are. So, yeah, but, uh, uh, but Greg's generally pretty confident that they will raise the rates, especially because other central banks have already raised their interest rates, essentially, Right? So it would be kind of weird for the for the Fed to you know say hey guys you raise interest rates but we won't like that that's that's just not going to happen right you know it's it's going to fuck everything up so so they better raise those interest rates get it over with and then hopefully when the markets go up cryptocurrencies will go up which will then pull up the price of Fox that's what I'm thinking and it'll also pull up the price of all my other tomb forks that are still somehow limping along on Yield Wolf okay. So, I guess we could just click the site, but there's just too many links for me to click. So, here's Fox Joe LP. So, this is really 14.18%. Okay. Here's Fox Share Joe, which is 18.6. Yeah, I figure this would be the real numbers 14.2% for Fox Snow. Okay. So, it looks like we're looking at 14 to 18 and a half. So, I'm going to write like 14 to. God, the problem is I've got to deal with fractions, but it's going to take up too much YouTube title space. So I'm going to do like, I'm going to do like 14 and 19 percent. I always do it that way. Okay, well I don't have to do that. So I'll do do 14 to 22 percent APR. This is uh, if you want to go all in on all shares. Uh, too, that's too much risk for me. And then this is a little under six percent. So yeah, I'm not going to include this, right? I'll just say that you could do the single stake if you really care to, but it's so low. Like, all this thing does is just leech money. But on the other hand, I don't really know what the devs are supposed to do either. Yeah, so, I mean, there's still a lot of total value locked in here. So, despite all this, it, it's still uh, it's still not helping. All right. So, two, four, five. Yeah, so I think, what's, I think it's because the TVL is very low on this. That's why the APRs are so high. Temporarily. This is obviously going to go down to, like, whatever these are. Then you got the good old-fashioned boardroom, all right? I mean, I didn't even bother checking for smart APR. I mean, there's just too much dilution going on. Uh, let's see. Let's hope they at least up update their documents. Okay, launch Genesis pools. Nope, that doesn't help me. Here are the farms. Tokens. This is over two months. Hmm. They are doing a rebate. Actually, is the rebates active? Because it's not under bond. It's under rebates. Excuse me. Uh, God, I really don't want to have to like manually figure this out. I think I'm going to manually figure this out. Yeah. I mean, these guys are kind of busy, so I guess that's why they haven't. Uh, 
Liquidity, incentives, Fox Snow, rebates. Okay, so they didn't update the docs. So now I have to like figure this out. Great. Okay, Fox Joe LP. We've got 81.2K. That's 14.2%. Uh, we got Fox Snow, which is 14.21%, 65K. So I would count this as half, right? Whatever this is, I have to take it by half because it's Fox Snow. So it's not the full, it's not the full thing here, full LP. So now the big moment of truth is Fox Share. Okay, so I think they're technically using the smart APR system. I mean, I figure they should because it should be the same as before. It just gets diluted because they have so many of these clown things open 35.6k yeah the, the apr is higher but there's more risk obviously because you're doing all shares and on top of that you know there's a lot less tbl locked so so that's why uh, and then i don't know how i don't know how i should count snow single stake on vox shares i mean technically it takes away from everything else but it doesn't like but it's a peg of the other one. So I guess technically I have to count this as a negative or a neutral, right? If I want to be nice. But because obviously this does not go towards, you know, buy pressure for Fox. So I think this is technically smart APR, but because there's like so many pools open. And again, this is what killed 2 ohm Snowy, Snow Tomb, uh, and probably uh, other projects. There's just too many like, for example, you look at Gray Finance and Zombie Finance. They still haven't gotten a list on Yield Wolf yet, right? And their prices are doing shit. I, I'm not surprised. You know why? Because they have too many pools, and worse, they overweighted. They always overweight rewards towards the shares. So, of course, the, pay, the, the, the base pay, uh, peg token can't make it. I'm pretty sure I mentioned that, too. Actually, yeah, I know I did it, right? And then, and then in the last video that I did for it, right, I just said they're not using the smart APR system. I'll wait and see if they at least try to implement it in zombie finance, and then we'll wait for Yield Wolf. But, you know, it's not looking too good. And, yeah, it's it's doing worse than ever. They haven't rug pulled from what I can tell. Actually, uh, oh, man. <sighs> okay, at least I remember this. Okay. Uh, 67 cents. These shares are $16.71. So yeah, I mean, just, just, just look at this. Just look at this. They have a TVL of 183. They're doing, they're still doing, they're still limping along somehow. Okay, TVL is down at 311.6. Yep, look, uh, it's just, it's like, yeah. All right, because they, because they haven't, I don't know, I'm not even going to bother to check because it, because I think on my, Yield Wolf, it still shows Grave shares way, paying out way more than Peg Token. So, yeah. But anyway, all right. So, you know, to be honest, I'm probably just going to write 14 to 45% daily APR uh, for the YouTube title. Because obviously you're not going to be doing this. You're going to be doing it here. Now, this is actually correct because, again, the TVLs are pretty low. I'd imagine when this video goes live, that actually will lower it a bit, but people are going to lower it anyway, so it might as well be you guys instead of some other person. So, anyway, check out uh, Arctic Fox. They do have a partnership, whatever that means, with Polar Bear Finance. I don't even know what these po partnerships actually do because they don't seem to do anything because I don't see their tokens mixing and matching, right, which is what I would interpret an actual partnership as. And if they're just sharing marketing, I mean, I guess that's fine, but chances are everyone kind of knows about each other anyway, so it, it really doesn't do anything, right? But I'm not going to make a video dedicated to say, hey, partnerships don't mean anything, right? I'm not going to, because again, I have a pretty strict uh, no FUD policy, right? So, yeah. Actually, I'm kind of curious. Uh, Dow King YouTube. I hope they'll give me the right channel, because I know he's been blowing up like crazy. 4.83. Uh, okay, so he finally did a video because retards are accusing him of being a part of the scam. Uh, this is why I don't take money for marketing videos, which, by the way, I probably should do that because I really could use the money, but, you know, whatever. Yeah, so he's still going pretty, uh, pretty strong. Uh, oh, man. Let me see. 
Yeah, I'm not actually sure why Dao King gets better search results than I do. Uh, Social Blade. Because uh, I haven't really heard him. I mean, I imagine he's still dealing with the Pulse Dao FUD, so he hasn't been saying anything on the Elite Discord. Um, let's just see what we get for here. Oh, somehow it kind of knew it was YouTube. All right, so yeah, he's been uh, doing really, really well. Hmm. Uh, I don't know if he's deleting some videos here. Yeah, that's kind of weird. I wonder what the algorithm is actually doing. I mean, there could just simply be a lot of search traffic for, say, Titano and Two Lump Three. That could be it too. Those are actually very large. You know, very large populations. Yeah. You know. All right. Well, whatever. I mean, my channel is growing too. It's a little slower, but whatever. I don't really. Well, I do kind of care, but, you know, I don't know, I'm just, I, it's just like a video game to me, right? I just want more stacks, right? I don't, why should I settle for 10 strength bonuses when I can get, like, 20 or 30, you know? So, anyway, I'm already rambling, so I'll see you in the next video. It will be, I kind of want to cover the meter, and it's already 8.48 a.m., but I'm, I don't want to leave for exercise and start my day until I get these three videos out. I just want to get all my crap out before sphere finance launches so i'll see you in the next video it's actually printer financial so this one's a little bit different and weird from what i'm used to so i'm not really sure how i'm gonna approach it but uh i'll, I'll deal with it when i upload this video so i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching and uh yeah check out uh, arctic fox again all right now that the genesis is over which thank you by the way you know that I, that surprisingly got like 400 views right which is pretty good for this really good for this channel it's actually twice what you normally get so now that they're on yield wolf thank god i can get a little bit of something right i mean i know because hey i know there's a legit project it's just under a lot of price pressure so i'm kind of hoping snowy all can also recover and then i'll have two you know halfway decent projects for the next few weeks throwing me you know in uh, passive income so uh stupid federal the federal reserve really better you know come through for us tomorrow man Ugh. all right See you next video. Uh, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. You know, share share the channel, etc. Because you know, again, you know, help me help you. Otherwise, you know, well, I guess it's over, right? <laughs> but you know, let, let's not. Let's, we'll make sure that doesn't happen. God will make sure that doesn't happen. <laughs>